Hello everyone, welcome back to Health Naturally. Today we will be discussing about a very common problem faced by all females during their reproductive age. Yes, I'm talking about menstrual problem. It may be scanty or no menstruation, heavy menstruation, painful menstruation and sometimes premenstrual symptoms like swollen and tender breast, acne, etc. If you are new to this channel, please subscribe to Health Naturally where I upload health-related videos every Saturday at 7 p.m. Like, share and comment and also share it with your friends and family members and get the benefit of your health from your home. Menstrual cycle is an effective monthly cleanse. So it is essential to support the process of cleansing. Arthava is defined as the periodical expulsion of blood through the vagina of an adult female. It is one of the most important physiological process. Based on the sign and symptoms, Ayurveda has explained the following types of menstrual flow. Vata menstrual flow. As Vata dominates the uterus, its Shita and Kara qualities, that is cold and rough, causes the blood vessels to constrict. Ruksha Guna, that is dry, depletes the bodily tissues and finally causes early cessation of menstrual flow. Due to decrease in plasma and blood tissues, decreased nourishment to the endometrial linings of uterus, the overall flow and menstrual discharge will be less. Wherever there is a blockage for the free flow of water, there will be pain. So, most of the water dominating cycles will be painful. Pitta menstrual flow. Pitta is hot and sharp. So it brings more fluidity to the blood so that it flows easily. Pitta resides in blood and in excess it may cause heavy bleeding. As it causes tendency for swelling, it leads to tender, swollen breast, acne, etc. that women experience during their premenstrual period. Kapha menstrual flow. Kapha is dull, heavy and sticky. Stronger the influence of Kapha dosha, the more likely to get a prominent growth of the endometrial tissues. As more blood vessels grow to supply this growth, the Kapha cycle is more likely to experience heavier flow than Vata cycle. Herbal care for healthy menstruation. Herbs can be used in accordance to the doshas involved. Paying an eye on the characteristic of menstruation will bring into light the doshas which is predominant in that cycle. They may also be depending on the prakriti of the individual. Application of theories related to doshas and practical application of drugs mentioned for particular doshas will help to cure the discomforts or ailments during menstruation. Vata dominating cycles will be painful. In Vatic cycle, mainly the Shumul can be used due to its work of pacifying Vata dosha. Ginger is another drug which helps in a vatic flow with discomfort. Pitta dominating cycles will have heavy bleeding and it leads to tender swollen breasts, acne, etc. Herbs which are really helpful in pitta flow are Ashoka as it tones the uterus and thus is a heavy flow. Shatavari, Amlaki, 
Guduchi, Kumari, Brahmi, etc. are useful herbs in Paitik flow as they are very famous for their Pitta pacifying action. Herbs which are really helpful in Kafaja flow are spices such as cinnamon, cardamom, black pepper, etc. are useful in cases of Kafaja cycle. Castor oil that is Aranda Taylor pack due to its warm and penetrating quality can break up the stagnation latent in the pelvis. These are some of the guidelines for healthy menstrual cycle. Consume simple, freshly prepared and hot food items. Try adding spices such as ginger, cardamom, cumin, coriander and cinnamon. Suppression of urges like urination, defecation and sneezing should be avoided. Meditation will bring peace of mind. Hydrate the body with warm teas such as ginger tea, lemon tea with honey, practicing pranayama for balancing the mind as it helps to equalize the right and left sides of the brain and yoga as per constitution will help our body strong and energetic. This video is just for educational and informative purpose and it should not replace your medical consultation. If you have any queries, please consult a registered Ayurveda doctor near you. Thank you.